Hi, we are the Birdhouse Builders. My name is Mason. I'm Jacob. And I'm Kyle. Our focus for the project was to make homes and safe places for bluebirds to live. Since a lot of trees have, got, have been getting cut down and replaced with the buildings, the trees are releasing carbon dioxide and not giving us oxygen we need from the trees. So overall, we are trying to just help the birds with somewhere they can go and feed out yeah, and feed safe. Our project is connected to climate change because every time a tree gets cut down, it releases carbon dioxide and we lose oxygen from when whatever tree that gets cut down. Also, greenhouse gases would increase. BBC.com says, without trees, formerly forested areas would become drier and more prone to extreme droughts. When rain did come, flooding would be disastrous. Massive erosion would impact oceans smoother and coral reefs and other marine habitats. An obstacle we faced was on our first birdhouse where we built the sides wrong and we had to measure out a new roof to fit. And we didn't throw away dirty pallets that we used to build. We cleaned them off, then used them instead of throwing them away. This impact we had, the impact we had is that we put the birdhouse outside. The birds who use them and live th live there or in that area. So overall, we were just trying to ha help the birds live a safer life. This is a picture of our first birdhouse that we built, the one where the sides were messed up, that we had to remeasure a new top so and then cut it so it would fit with the sides. This is the in-progress photo on the birdhouse we are currently working on. That We have the sides built, the base built, and the bottom but we don't have the roof for the back yet this is a complete birdhouse outside in the back of our school that is built and ready for the birds we had to learn to use a few new tools while we were doing this project this is a circular saw showing right now and that was way easier to use than the jigsaw that is shown right now the jigsaw moved a lot when you were cutting and was a little harder to line up than the circular saw but overall they were both a very good tool to use for our project Here's a map I made of the trees that have been torn down in New Jersey. They have torn down so many trees in Ocean Township in the past years, and on Google Maps it shows that the trees are still up. They are adding housings, Wawa's, and other buildings, and there's a picture of the trees. The picture on the bottom right, the trees are on the map, but in real life there's just no trees there, and they've started to build new places there. On the left, near the stars where the school is, and then another brown spot below it, the brown spot used to be trees, but they are destroying trees to make new things, which isn't good for birds and overall environment.